stuff that uh, you sort of want to set out to accomplish? Um, I really uh, want to continue to work for NWA Smoky Mountain Wrestling. And I really want to continue to get on the Future of Honor shows and maybe get a, a spot on Ring of Honor, of course. Um, mm. That and, you know, just get get uh, Let's Go Nuts out everywhere. Uh, and the thing about what I do is, is I, I do it because I love wrestling and I do it because it's something that I'm, I feel like I'm very good at. And it's something that I can do to uh, kind of influence people and help people. Um, I actually have a friend. Her name is Ashley DePriest. And she's only in her late twenties and she's currently fighting leukemia cancer. Hmm. Uh, that, you know, I, <laughs> I complain, you know, wrestling's hard, you know, this is hard. Why don't like, why doesn't this happen for me? You know, that's a real fight. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She's a real fighter. And it was kind of a eye opener for me. I, after my last VOW show, I actually got a chance to speak about Ashley and about her fight and about how people could, you know, um, help out and i realized that wrestling is so much bigger than what happens in the ring and wrestling's wrestling's something that uh you know i can use you know my success or whatever you want to call it i can use it not just for myself but for the people i love you know and people will rely on me and uh i guess that that that's what i want to do i want to i want to Fi- keep finding new purposes for wrestling, you know, like helping Ashley. And, you know, even if it's people just liking her, her page for the fight against cancer, that means a lot, you know, and that's cool that I was able to use my Avenue and my route to help her and her fight. So that's what I want from this year. I want to, I want to get more places. I want to, I want to get Jimmy nuts everywhere I can. And I want to spread let's go nuts because it's not just a catchphrase. And of course, it's kind of a funny and you that everyone makes fun of. But uh, <laughs> I've said this before. It's it's really a mindset because uh, I didn't have the best childhood. I didn't have the best teenage years. I was really overweight. I was picked on. I was bullied. And I lost 100 pounds. And I didn't do that because I'm some amazing athlete or anything. I did that because, you know, when life pushes you down. And, you know, you're overweight or people are bullying you or people are telling you're not good enough or you lose your job or you get, you know, diagnosed with cancer. You're sick. You got to You have to get a little crazy. You got to get a little nuts and you have to push through that. And like when life's telling you no, you have to tell it yes. Mm-hmm. And when everyone else is telling you no around you, you say yes. And you're, everyone's going to call you crazy. They're going to laugh at you. They're going to call you nuts. They're going to call you insane. But the thing is, is that you keep on going. And that's really what Let's Go it Nuts is. Like, of course, it's a fun chant. It's an innuendo to some people. <laughs> but at the deep of what I'm doing, that's what it really is. And uh, I guess if I have a closing word. Um, like, two years ago, I told everybody I just wanted to prove all everyone that doubted me wrong. And I wanted to prove everyone that ever said I couldn't do this, that I could. And you know, I want to make it to WWE. And... My main reason for that used to be because I want to, I want to, you know, shut everybody up. I want to rub it in their faces. I want to, you know, all the haters or whatever people call it. I don't care about that anymore, man. I don't care about um, proving anybody wrong. Uh, I just want to prove all the people who love me and all the people who have supported me and all my fans, my family, my friends, all the people that rely on me. I just want to prove them right because they believe in me and I believe in me. <laughs>